Good morning. It is the 29th of December, 2021, Wednesday. And um, excuse me for any of the, the camera wobbly or the sound not good. I just, man, I've had such a morning. I was sitting up here to, to record a quick video. Um, and um, gosh, I broke, I broke my... Um, tripod <laughs> my camera doesn't seem like it's working now so i'm using my um, cell phone but I still this wasn't what i was going to do it on but i said i have this we might as well um do the um do a video quick video here okay so uh hope y'all had a great christmas i did grilled out on christmas my, my normal custom i'm going to do the same thing on new year's everything should be great and again, excuse me for any of the movement, but this is what you're looking at, Knights at War. It says, with four realistic medieval war games, and it's Oozborn Battle Games, maybe, right? I have had, I bought this later, uh, but I had these when I was a kid. I had all of them. There's three here, but there's five in total. There's Knights at War, World War II. Galactic War, which is which is good. I've got I, I've got the original Galactic War. Um, still in hardback. I got the hardback and um, Ships at War Two, I think, is what it was called. But there's another there's a another um, ship combat game which a uh, book. I love these for a couple of reasons. First of all, if you can see they um, about this book, they gave you a lot of history and background right so we're looking at warriors on horseback they're talking about you know knots in medieval times and you got here um fought for the holy land crusaders you gave you a really good hit these are by andrew mcneil i believe his name is um due to the key maker uh he produced i think all of these battle books um heraldy right there that talking about you know Right, so it's giving you all that downfall of the knights, right? Downfall of the knights, and it's giving you all that information, right? Um, it's giving you the timeline, knights' time, right? Ten sixty to fourteen ninety two, which I would pretty much agree with. And it gives you four battles, right? It gives you four different games, and it's telling you this is siege, right? And it's giving you the um, <laughs> the counters, right? Here's the counters. Border Raiders. Right? And here's the games. And that's where they come in. There's a tournament. What the tournament is. A jousting tournament or whatever you want to call it. Right? Hex and counter maps. Maps are kind of cool. Siege War. Going to give you background. Then you're going to go right into Siege. Another cool little game. All right. So, talking about different weapons. You're talking about a Morning Star. Talking about, I think Flails are in here. You're talking about crossbows. And Border Raiders. There's, a, there's another game. And then tournament which is you know but these games were so cool to me so cool there's tournament your tournament counters siege counters here these books were so cool to me um some of them i think i did play all of them at one time or the other uh at least a part of all of them. Um, this one I brought back because, you know, um, I, I try to buy back because I bought, bought them all back because they're cool. And although I did play them, I read these more than anything else. I would wear them out reading them just about the history behind it and whatnot. And they, they were just cool books. Uh, they're all produced in the 70s. I think all of them produced in 75 except one. It may have been produced in... 76 or 77 maybe 78 i don't remember 
But um, yeah, they were just cool. And um, I just wanted to get a quick video out because so much trouble this morning with uh, trying to do another video. So, all right, y'all. Have a great day. Sorry about the shoddy camera work. And um, y'all have a happy new year. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.